Margot, what have you got in store for us? I got talent! The auditions have returned once again to the windy city of Chicago, where thousands are here to audition for a shot at the million dollars and the chance to perform on the Las Vegas Strip. Showtime! Chicago style. With a million dollars and a Vegas performance on the line, every act is looking for that all-important edge. And for some, it's about introducing an element of danger. Planning to attempt what he believes is the most dangerous act the judges will have ever seen is 39-year-old Kevin Taylor. My name is Kevin Taylor, and I'm the world fastest brick worker. This is a one inch by eight by 16 slab. If you don't do this the correct way, it's very dangerous. When I go out there and perform speed brick breaking, most people reaction. They just shake their head, they can't believe it, it's amazement. You blink your eyes, 50 bricks are broke. This is a huge opportunity that I've been working for my whole life. If I make any mistakes, I can really hurt myself because it's dangerous. By being here today can change all the doubters and make people take me serious as an entertainer, as a martial artist, and as a person. What's your name? My name is uh, Kevin Taylor. And what are you going to do for us today? I'm going to attempt to break 1,000 pounds of cement, that's 100 bricks, on fire. Do you think that what you do is worth a million dollars? Oh, certainly, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. All right, Kevin. Go for it. Come on. He's going to set all these things on fire. He's going to break through the bricks. This is incredibly dangerous what he's doing. I happen to know that he broke his bones trying to do this in the past. So we'll see what happens. No, ma'am. Are you sure? Hands. Your hands oh, okay? Fine. Thank you. All right. So, um, Piers. Wow. I mean, that was explosive. I mean, incredible to watch. Thank you. What I liked about the act was that you took a martial arts. We've seen, we've seen lots of martial art acts, and they're always quite boring, actually, because they do what they would do in the gym. Yes, sir. What you did was make it entertaining. Thank you. Kevin, I, that was awesome. I, I, Thank you. Absolutely incredible what you just did. I know that America wants to see you again. I just know it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Kevin, I've never seen anything like that. It's scary, though. I'm really scared. I, <laughs> I was really shocked when all your hands were on fire. And Yes. Well, you'd be the best bodyguard in the... <laughs> no, you're like a big teddy bear, Kevin. Yes, yes. Okay, well, we're going to vote. David, yes or no? I want to see what you got up your sleeve next. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Kevin, I mean, I'm in awe about what you do, but I don't want to be a part of seeing you get hurt. Not on my watch, so I'm going to say no. Oh. I mean, Kevin, look, you've got to convince me that we're not just going to get really the same thing again. My goal is to break brick, land on my back. They drop it down on me, and I hit it with my fingers before it hit me. All right, well, I like your spirit, so I'm going to say yes. Thank you. I have never seen that before. I've been working for this moment my whole life. Coming up on America's Got Talent. 
We have got singers we've already put through who are better singers than you. I won't let you down. It's not about letting me down, it's about whether I think you can win. I can win. Welcome back to America's Got Talent, where the Chicago auditions are in full swing. The backstage area is packed to overflowing, and not just with performers chasing their dreams. Almost every person here has come with a loved one to cheer them on, and that support is crucial when the nerves kick in. These two individuals mean the world to me. My friends and family are behind me 100%. It means a lot. And no one is more grateful for the love and support of her husband than 38-year-old realtor, Shalina. My name is Shalina Black Harris. I am 38 years old. I am a vocalist. When I hear my wife sing around the house, her voice just moves me. In my heart, I feel like if she touches me like that, I want to share it with the world. Singing has seen me through some hard times. Less than two years ago, my life took a drastic turn. I was diagnosed with cervical cancer. And I sat on the couch, and all of a sudden, tears just flowed and flowed, and I couldn't stop them. I was imagining how could I go on not having her there with me. And he said, babe, I'm so scared, I'm so worried about you. And I just told him, I was determined. I'm going to live. I just celebrated being a year of being cancer free. So I'm just grateful and I just take this as my opportunity. I know she has it in her. You know, it's just believing in God that she can do it. So what's your name? My name is Selena. Selena. Shalina, what are you going to do for us today? I am going to sing for you today. What you do, is it worth a million dollars? Yes, it is. Oh. I believe so. Okay, come on. Stage is yours. I was born by the river Whoa. in a little tea. Oh, and just like that river, I've been running ever since. It's been too living. Well, I ain't afraid to die. It's been a long, long, long time. You know, you come out here and you got the sweetest smile. And I go, oh gosh, it's going to be so hard to vote her off. And then you come out with this amazing instrument. And you are what the show's about. Okay, Piz. Um, I thought it was a good audition. I didn't think it was great. I thought it was a bit... Oh. Well, 